Hi, my name is Nasser Mohammadi. I am one of the application engineers working at Texas Instruments. Today, I would like to demonstrate LMH1218. LMH1218 is the industry first cable driver with integrated reclocker. Applications for LMH1218 are video format converters, SDI routers, distribution amplifiers, and switchers. Please first allow me to go over features of LMH1218. Here you could see that LMH1218 cable driver with integrated reclocker supports dual protocol, SDI and 10 gigabit ethernet. And also this means that it supports dual media, coax, 75 ohm coax, and fiber. Additionally, LMH1218 reclocks data rates all the way from 11.88 to 270 megabits 70 SDI data rates and 10.3125 gigabits Ethernet. Also, LMH1218 has 2 to 1 input MUX and 1 to 2 fan out on the output drivers. Please allow me to now go through the block diagram of the device. LMH1218 has 200 ohm differential input followed by loss of signal indicator on each input and FR4 equalization that the user sets. After FR4 equalization there is a 2 to 1 MUX followed by reclocker. In SEMTI mode basically we have 75 ohm output drivers and 100 ohm differential output drivers. In SEMTI mode, 75 ohm output driver is used to drive coax and the second 100 ohm differential driver is used to either retime, is used either for retime data, recovered clock, raw data, or mute. In 10 gig E, Normally, the first output is powered down and the second output is used for retime 10.3125 gigabits Ethernet data rate. Now, please allow me to go through the overall demonstrations setup. As you can see, we have a Agilent BERT generating 11.88 uh, data rates and the output of the bird goes through 20 inches of 4 mil FR4 and on the output of the 20 inches of FR4 we go to one of the inputs of LMH1218. Here it is LMH1218. LMH1218 coax or out BNC driving is driving one meter of Berlin 1694A going to one of the inputs of scope. And as you can see, total jitter is 20.1 picosecond. And this is 75 ohm cable driver. Next, I would like to show you a second waveform. To do that, I'll go ahead and turn on the math function first. Auto scale. And here, 100 ohm differential output driver has 16 picoseconds of total jitter. Next, I would like to go to set up the dev device for 10.3125 gigabit Ethernet. To do that, I'll go ahead and use the GUI to set up the device for 10.3125. As you can see, the GUI, it is detecting SEMT and it is locked at 11.88. The output, the, uh, the horizontal eye opening, it is 0.76 UI and vertical eye opening is 487 millivolt. I'll go ahead and set up the device for 10 gig E. 
apply and as you can see device went out of lock because the data rate is at 11.88 now I change the data rate from 11.88 to 10.3125 gig device is in lock horizontal eye opening is 0.82 UI and vertical eye opening is 525 millivolt next I would like to go on the scope and show you the eye mask to do that first I need to upload 10 gig e transmit 10 gig mask and then click start mask test and as you can see there is a wide margin and also zero violations in summary I have shown you LMH 1218 the industry's first 12G cable driver with integrated reclocker for additional info please visit ti.com slash LMH 1218. Thank you for watching this video.